Good morning, everyone. Ooh, I thought I'd wake up with you to see what's going on in the garden this morning. Oh, I do have to put the artificial lights, as I said, because it takes such a long time for the sun to finally hit me, and when it does, it's on an angle. Anyways, nevertheless, Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh oh. Those are different lettuces. They're very leggy. They were given by a neighbor. She had sewn the whole package in uh, about a space like this. And I told her, no, 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 you don't need all that. Well, here I'm giving her advice and look at me. I've got lots of it, but it's too leggy. It's not good when it's leggy, so we'll have to fix that by adding some soil, very, very, very fluffy light soil, and uh, within the next couple of days it'll be getting cold, uh, excuse me, warmer outside, so we'll be able to put that outside soon and put a, a blankie or a actual tarp or covering at night. Anyways, over here I did transplant my... Uh, cucumbers and then this is your zucchini there's a couple of corn believe it or not I just put them in there because they were for some seeds for the birds and I just picked them out because I know these birds around here don't eat those kind of seeds anyhow this is yellow bean and as you can see I've got some microgreens growing a piece of cabbage there was something going on with the cabbage Lucky I kind of brought it to a, an area so I could see it. So that piece is going to be coming off right away. I have some kind of, ah, uh, God, what are they called? Some kind of fungus anyway. So hopefully it's not bothering the plants I bought from the store. Ah, uh, so yeah, and then we've got the peppers. These are supposed to be more... I don't know, these are tomatoes, different types of tomatoes. They're not starting very fast. I'm going to leave that on there. He should be in the dark. So there's lots going on over here of more microgreens, but I decided to put these ones in soil to see how they do. So there's quite a mixture in there. things and then I've got seeds and bags who are waiting to get planted this week finally we got some strawberries and a pepper there just to help me feel like I'm not starting fully from the beginning this is oh good it took this is um which we call it kale. So we got the kale going. Kale is happy. I had to, like I said, rescue them because of these gnats. That's what it's called. So finally, let's look here. Ooh, that's two more other varieties of kale. And they are among some uh, carrots, which will take a little while to come up. But woohoo, there's gonna be beautiful kale. I can't wait. In here, I don't know if you can see it. We've got more microgreen type stuff going on. I don't know if they're gonna take, because I forgot about them for a moment. Now, the piece de resistance, my potatoes, yes, they are reaching for the sky, they love it in the warmth, oh my god, there's so many, he's bursted through, look at these guys, wow, they're not even green yet, because they burst through, through the last day or two, and then as you can see, look, 
there's a seedling there. I don't know if you can see it. Yes, I don't know what that is. Ooh, there's another seedling. Where, 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 where is it? Uh, hard to see in here because it's dark right now. Ooh, there's a few seedlings. Oh, I'm seeing one over there. Look at this one, it just popped out overnight. Ooh, more potatoes. There's like three, four different types of potatoes in here. Three for sure. Yippee, yippee, yippee. But yeah, what a mess. Oh goodness. The stuff a garden haul it does, whether you're in a small space garden or not. I had to bring the stuff even out of the greenhouse. But lucky for me, I did have the greenhouse and I did have the heater, which shaved all this. It will all still seed, I'm thinking. But if some don't, look at all that we have already. This is plenty. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, well, grow with me. Make sure, even if you have a small balcony, which I have eight are about 10-ish by four feet. Um, do grow, 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 grow. Plant that seed, even if it's one plant that you grow from uh, and then buy from the store and grow. Do it, do it, do it. It's so exciting, it's so fun to watch it grow from a seed into that large thing, sometimes a wee tiny little seed. And like, for example, the um oh look look there's a couple of volunteers who've come in but uh this kale grows immense it grows up to three feet some of it yes so yeah grow your food people enjoy even take your scraps that you get out of the store cut it properly uh things like cabbage cut it to the core, around the core, and then let it grow, get some, uh, some, um, roots, and keep an eye on it. Like I said, I had this planted, but I ended up having to uproot it, which luckily I did, and good, and so yeah, let's watch the progress, keep growing everyone it's a wonderful day it's april 25th so beautiful day happy health to you even through this times that we're having in 21 now it's still lingering from 20 do your best to just keep your mind happy and active and grow grow plants i've even got apples and different other things growing okay well, click like, subscribe, stay tuned for more progress as we grow together. Put in your comments what you're growing and if you think I'm growing too much. <laughs>